Hey guys, what's up? Welcome back to my channel or welcome if you are new here. If you're new, my name is Natalie. I would love for you to hit that subscribe button and join the fam bam. I am an accounting major currently uh, getting my master's degree and I go to the University of North Texas and I graduate at the end of this year. So super fun and exciting. Um, today's Tuesday. It's September 6th and it's three o'clock in the afternoon. Um, this morning I went to work, I worked the early shift and then after I got off work I went to Trader Joe's, got two creamers, some tulips, uh, some strawberries and like these pumpkin uh, dark chocolate granola bite things. I don't know, they just sounded really good. And um, I've been going back and forth with Becker, like I've just been having a really hard time so basically the package that I'm wanting to buy from Becker is $2,400 and I thought for some reason that tax wasn't going to be that much. And when she told me the total, she was like, the total is $2,630.49. And I was like, oh, okay, well that's not going to work. And so basically I had to go back and forth between my bank and Becker because I had to raise the debit card, my debit card limit and um and then i had to call becker back and then call the bank back and like back and forth and it's just been crazy and so now i literally just got paid and now like if i were to buy becker today which basically the the limit on my debit card expires at the end of today otherwise i have to call back and like do this all over again and honestly it's such a hassle um but if i buy becker today i literally have like no money left and so then i'm gonna have to go back to my savings account which i already withdrew this month and they're gonna charge me a fee now if i have to withdraw again so basically yeah it's a rough situation and yeah i'm dealing with that so i'm gonna try and buy my becker stuff today like even though i don't really want to but i have to because like i just can't wait longer i can't i can't push my becker materials off longer especially since i'm taking the um the cpa prep course this semester like i just need to have my materials with me so yeah fun stuff i just love being an adult it sucks uh but anyways what else um i don't have class tonight we basically meet only every other tuesday so tonight he's just giving us the night to catch up on our becker stuff um for those of you that are new to my channel i'm only taking two classes this semester because like i said i graduate in december so i'm taking a it audit and then a professional exam competency class which is basically like a cpa prep class built into the bsms program at my university which is super helpful so for the cpa prep class i don't really have like too many assignments do it's mainly like modules and uh like multiple choice stuff in becker and then i have like a mini exam one for reg and then audit i don't know if they're doing like bec or um far at all but so yeah i'm only taking two classes this semester and i will be done it's super exciting honestly i'm just at that point where i don't want to do anything i don't even want to study for the cpa exam which is very sad to say but i've been in school for so long and it just it's so annoying that i graduate but at the same time i still have to study for my cpa exam so like i'm done but i'm not really done if that makes sense so it's just annoying um but yeah, so we're just going to do like a week in my life kind of thing uh, as a college student accounting major. Um, oh, by the way, I took my, my last barista test today and I got a 99 on my test. So your girl is officially a barista and today was my last day of training. So tomorrow is like my first full day as a barista, like on my own and all that stuff. So super exciting. Um, it's just like a temporary job and super fun. Um, but yeah, so... I'm just gonna kind of take you along a couple days or like a week in my life whatever and go from there i need to like clear my head for a second because i've just gone through so much between becker and like my bank and all that stuff i've been on the phone non-stop so i'm gonna take a break i need to make some i want to make some cold brew and i didn't really have coffee this morning i made coffee at work 
but I didn't even drink half of it. I just like tossed it out because I, I get free coffee now, so I just make it at work. Um, but sometimes, like when I'm at home, I'll use my Nespresso now, or like I'll use um, just like cold brew. So I'm gonna make something later and get the show on the road. So I'll catch up with you guys later on. So I recently got this like a couple weeks ago. It's the oat creamer. This is a brown sugar flavor from Trader Joe's. This is really good. This is actually my second time purchasing this one. Um, I love it. It's It just makes a big difference. And I've been kind of doing like a brown sugar uh, cold foam on top of cold brew. So I'll just use my Nespresso frother back there and just froth it up. But today I decided to buy this one. This is the coconut and almond creamer and it's the vanilla flavor. I kind of wanted to try this one because this was really good and I'm just curious like I'm just I don't go to Trader Joe's that often. So honestly, I'm just really curious as to how this is gonna taste. Smells good. Okay, this one did not froth up as good as the oat creamer. I guess just oat creamer in general froths a lot better than almond and coconut milk. Um, so we're gonna try it. It's good. I think I put too much creamer because it's a little too sweet, but it's really good. I just took a shower and I also was able to finally purchase my CPA uh, Becker package. And now I'm just going in and redeeming my reg book. So I think I'm just gonna I'm gonna start with reg the the reg CPA exam first and then move to the rest of the three parts later on. I do want to do the BEC exam before like the whole accounting revolution in 2024. I think because in 2024 they're like basically changing a lot of the CPA testing stuff. Um, so I want to get this done before that. So I'm just filling in some stuff on um, Becker. Okay, so this is the whole... So I'm in Becker right now. As you can see here, there are four parts to the CPA exam. I just redeemed the reg CPA exam. So my book hopefully will be shipping pretty quickly. I hope, fingers crossed. So technically I'm supposed to have my book while I'm doing all of these modules and um, like mini exams and stuff, but I don't have my book yet. So we're just gonna go with the flow. We're gonna go to R1, which is like the very first chapter. And you can see here R1 has modules one through five that I have to complete. And then I believe it has like a mini exam I think but there's practice tests there's flashcards um so I was playing around with the outline and these are basically the pdf notes that Becker provides you and then you watch the lecture and I guess kind of follow along with the with all the notes but you have all these options so you can like just view it, you can annotate it, you can highlight, add a text box, like scratch out, underline, um, you have different shape tools, you can insert different things. I can also download it to my iPad as well. So I have that option. Or apparently there's also a pre-annotated ebook. So I guess it has all of the um, notes on here, I guess annotated from the lecture. So everything in red is the annotated notes. So I have that option as well. Haven't figured out what is gonna be the best method for me to retain the information yet.
Good morning, guys. Today is Wednesday. It's the 7th and it's 8 o'clock in the morning. I woke up pretty early this morning. Um, Chris just started a new job and he actually got a like internship position at the same firm um, that I was working at. I kind of hooked him up a little bit. So he starts that this week. So he woke up around six this morning and my body is kind of used to waking up early anyways since um, being a barista, I had to be at work pretty early. So I wasn't able to go back to sleep. So I decided to go to Albertsons really quickly and get some more oat milk and um, a couple other things that I kind of needed. Um, I feel like we go to the store all the time. I don't understand. I feel like there's just always something that we need and like I can't get a break from it. But um, okay, so I just got some more of the blonde roast cold brew or iced coffee and then some more of the planet oat, oat milk this is the extra creamy version i don't really put a whole lot anyways but i i like this one instead of just like the regular planet oat one i don't know and then i got some more of dave's killer bread this is this is the thin sliced 70 calorie one this is really good freshly toasted um, I like to use that for like cottage cheese uh, with like tomatoes on top or like, I don't know, peanut butter on it. Like whatever it is, they're just really good. Got some bananas. Got some dryer sheets. Some Airwick um, infused like scents for the plug. Like they're just plug-ins. This is the apple cinnamon medley. I figured it would go with like the fall uh, season. And then they had Celsius that was buy three, get one free. And we're kind of low on it. So I picked up four and that's all I got. some hot water going i'm gonna make some green tea i've been making ice cream tea um for like the past couple weeks it's just just really good it goes good like in the afternoon or even in the morning just nice and cold and um i'm trying to see if it works with like my digestion and bloating um and i think it is honestly i've noticed a little difference in my bloating so but This is the green tea that I'm using. I just picked a random one and I let it steep in a cup and then I just like put it in the fridge until I'm ready to drink it. For breakfast, I have these prepped overnight oats in here. So I'm gonna eat that. For breakfast, I already took my thyroid medication, so I am able to eat now.
since we last spoke, baby You were so cold that you drove me crazy Don't know where to go, lose control Think I need to let it go my camera crooked okay whatever um hi guys I am home it is about six o'clock um I just got off a little while ago um and I'm home now um work was good this morning I don't really know remember if I talked to you guys this morning or not but I basically did like a load of laundry I don't think I showed that part, but I also worked a little bit on Becker, but it's really hard to work on Becker when I don't have my book yet, and I don't even know if it's shipped out. When I clicked redeem my book on Becker, it said you should I should get a shipping confirmation within 24 to 48 hours, so I haven't gotten one yet. I'm hoping my book ships out like ASAP um, because the outline notes doesn't it's not the full note the full notes it doesn't include everything that i need so i'm waiting for my book so i can follow along with the notes um and like fill in everything or i mean i could use the uh pre-annotated ebook but i really want to like write down the notes and follow along that way i can like learn more by writing so I worked on that a little bit and then I watched a little bit of One Tree Hill. I've been binge watching One Tree Hill. I've never watched it before and I am like obsessed with it. It's so good. Um, it's on Hulu. And what else? I had two coffees this morning. I had my green tea and I don't honestly, I don't remember. Oh yeah. And then I went to like Albertsons and stuff like that. But I'm so hungry. Chris should be home here in a little bit. We have some leftover spaghetti and turkey meatballs from last night. So we're going to have that for dinner. And I'm going to take a shower and pretty much like chill the rest of the night. Um, and I'll just catch up with you guys tomorrow. guys it is um a lot later in the afternoon today's thursday september 8th i don't know if i talked to you guys this morning or not um but if i didn't if i didn't talk to you guys i literally didn't do anything except becker like i've been doing becker all day long um chris made breakfast this morning i just ate avocado toast um, did my usual ice green tea and had some cold brew coffee and I've just been doing Becker all day so I've just I've been struggling with some of these questions um, I I really need my book and I'm hoping my book ships like ASAP like I said I redeemed it and everything but I like my I need my book so I can follow along and like have my book in front of me highlight take notes and like it's just it's better to have the book in front of you and um for my PEC class I have my reg mini exam one due on the 13th so 
so i pretty much have to like start without my book anyways but when i get my book i'll just have to i guess like review some of this stuff but i plan on taking my reg cpa course first and then probably far audit and then bec last i want to try and get them done as quickly as possible and as fast as possible because i'm just like over i'm over school i'm over studying like i just i can't i'm over it so i've been kind of struggling i'm right now i'm working on r1 m3 but i did not finish the sim for um module two and then i think there was another there was another thing I didn't finish on there as well, but I was struggling with module two, which is like gross income part one. So it basically talks about everything that's considered like non-taxable, taxable, like what is included in gross income, what's excluded, all of that stuff. I was just having difficult, uh, a difficult time with like answering the multiple choice questions and stuff. Um, so I'm just taking, I took a break from that for a little bit and was watching One Tree Hill and then now I'm just kind of skipping that module i'm going to come back to it but i'm going to move on to module three which is gross income part two and i'm about to leave here in a little bit to go to my it audit class hey guys it's friday um i did go to work this morning and i look like a hot mess like i sweated so much at work today my mascara basically like just went everywhere um so ignore that but work was super busy um and after that, I stopped at Ross and like picked up a couple of fall pieces to wear. And then I came home and I've been watching One Tree Hill for the past like hour, I would say. I also ate lunch when I got home too. Um, and now I'm about to go to our apartment gym and do a glute and um, I'm thinking like glute and maybe hamstring workout it's been like two weeks since the last time i worked out um which is really not good because i'm trying to be consistent but it's just so hard when i just feel so tired all the time um and then i'm gonna come back shower and then do some more becker stuff and then make a coffee as well so we're gonna go hit a workout real quick Hi guys, I am back from the gym. Um, the workout was okay. I only worked out for like 20 minutes and my legs were already shaking. Like I said, it's been a couple weeks since I've worked out. So it's just so hard. Like I really need to stay consistent with it. It's just really hard. But I just made some cold brew. It's so good. My makeup looks terrible. My sunscreen is just like... I need to shower and wash my face. I sweated so much at work this morning and then I just sweated at the gym. So my makeup is like, it looks like it's like all over my face. But um, I need to do a little bit of some Becker stuff. So I plan on finishing module two because I did take a break from that the other day because it was really hard. Um, and then I need to finish module three as well. All of, or both of those are on R1. I think there's like, set there's r1 through r7 i think um and i'm still on r1 so uh my becker reg book did ship out so i should be receiving that very soon thankfully because it's really hard to study without having my book in front of me so i hopefully that hopefully that comes in like asap it shouldn't take more than like five to seven business days so um, but yeah, other than that, I'm, I don't really have a whole lot going on besides taking a shower. I do work tomorrow morning and then, like I said, just going to work on some Becker stuff and I'll probably watch One Tree Hill like the rest of the evening and have a pretty chill night. Like I said, um, there's only like, there's only so much I can vlog without it being super repetitive and boring um so i've pretty much done kind of the same thing the past couple days uh you know work becker like school all that stuff um oh yeah i did go to class last night and he went on the whole like three hours and yeah that was pretty much it i came home ate dinner and like went to bed but yeah i don't have anything else going on so i'm just gonna go ahead and end the vlog here um, if you guys like this stuff or like this content, give this video a thumbs up and leave a comment down below. 
and yeah that's all i have to say so i will see you guys in my next video thank you so much for watching love you Thank you.